Good evening YouTube viewers and subscribers. So today I just finished up reassembling and putting in new bearings in and reassembling this Sato FA72A engine that I got uh, earlier in the week, maybe it was late last week, from a local modeler. So this will be the first time I've ever run this engine. I've got an APC 13.6 prop on here, an OSF glow plug, and some Morgan's Omega 5% this particular tank just so happened to be on here from another run, so it has uh, additional caster in it. Um, the bearings I got, I want to do a shout out to Brant from eBay. Uh, really great guy. Gets me bearings quickly, and they're right, and they're good quality bearings. Um, I've gone away from using RC bearings because they just screwed up too many of my orders, and their bearings are pretty crappy. So, Brant. Thank you very much for supplying me bearings for this engine and several others. Let's see how this engine runs. Let's see how she draws fuel. Draw fuel quite well. Okay, so there you have it. A great running Sato engine, as usual. Uh, unfortunately, my tack was giving me, well, it wasn't my tack that was giving me some issues. It was where I'm at. Uh, half in the shade, half in the sun, a cloud would come through. So the tack was showing some pretty strange readings, and it was all because of shadowing and, and things like that. I tried the best I could during this run to get it straightened out. 
basically it was hitting 10,000 RPM and it was idling around 26 to 2700 RPM reliably you saw the transition regardless of what the tack was saying you actually saw how it ran how it sounded when it shut off at the end there which I may end up editing out it was because I ran out of fuel it wasn't because it leaned out and shut down it was because I didn't have as much fuel in here as I thought and it ran out so anyway it's just another beautiful running Sato engine I mean man I love these things I love all Sato engines and this is another winner so thank you for watching